Hello everyone, Artan here. Welcome back to Let's Play Archimedean Dynasty. So, we've picked up some missions. Let's see which one we have. Meet Captain Yala Raccoon in Ubebo. I think that's a primary quest mission. Disable the boat of the Muhammad's family at Kanisha 1. I am guessing that is probably an off quest. So, let's just save that for a bit and go have a chat at... Oh, wow. There's quite a few things to visit. Let's just have a look see around. How about that? Ganesha Wan, quarrying of red deep sea clay, 5,254 meters. Nothing here. Um, Sherelle, there's one. Sheherazad's world. Sheherazad's. Leisure complex. 1,820 meters. Huh. Passerby. Shalom, I am Sarah. Are you from Europe, from the Atlantic? Yes, I'm a guest of your inner fair city. Are you a warrior? Only when I have to be. Why don't you go and admire the beauties of the Union? Your soul will be at peace. Peace. I need the cash to have my boat supplied. I owe a guy called Atropo a lot of money. Peace means wealth for the soul. In Babel, you will find my brother Pagda. He is a poet and a great traveler. He will tell you about peace and the riches of the world. Alright. I'm a Tancred. What can I do for you, mercenary? Oh, I can think of so many things. Shall I put them in alphabetical order? You want to know something about our cultural offerings, don't you? Um, sure, I want to learn everything about the Union legends. Okay, here we go. The Tancred family is prominent in the field of music. We produce every instrument you can think of, from the underwater organ to historically accurate reconstructions. Yeah, what about physical well-being? Eating, drinking, relaxation? Interesting. Do you also make proper violins, flutes, pianos, and trumpets? More or less, the low density of the Helinox breathing gas means that, although though additional semi-acoustic amplifiers are needed on wind instruments, we use patented resonance techniques on other instruments. Crap. What material are you are the instruments made of? Out of. I've read that our forefathers made them partially from precious wood. We partially use Indian synthetic wood produced from seagrass, cellulose fibers, and polysaccharide molecular change. This produces a resonance effect that, like that of old-fashioned wooden instruments. Alright. Cool. Um, no job, though. Teacher. Shalam, you come from Europe, don't you? Yes, and you're an Indian prisoner, since aren't you? No, I'm an elementary school teacher in floating Bombay. Interesting. What's the educational system like in a clan junction? We put emphasis on individuality throughout a child's education. They all have their own character, their own way of learning, our own talents. We prefer to encourage instead of leveling to the lowest common denominator. That's interesting. In the Shogunate, children are educated according to their genetic requirements. That's just propaganda and nothing else. The truth is that the Shogunate doesn't educate according to the genes, but simply prevents its citizens from having their own experiences. Sounds like you might even produce happy children to boot. I can't see how that's anything but good. We must learn to light aqua with happiness and spiritual prosperity. A child so touched is the most beautiful light of all. Oh, nice. Alright. New Babel. New Babel, Leisure Complex, 1,632 meters. Ah, we're going. Let's talk to the merchant. Shalom, do you want to buy some liquid light, dream tablets, music from the aquaspheres, chocolate made from real coca beans? Sorry, I'm not a millionaire from Neopolis. But perhaps you'd like remote-controlled mini-video robot, a VF, VLF transceiver, a control seat for your boat with an intelligence massage program. What's the point of that? 
it relaxes you on long journeys. How about art? I've got parts of famous masterpieces. Ludwig the Sixteenth Hand, Mona Lisa's Smile, The Halo of Bosch Tanthony. Help, I am being bored to death. I've got medieval magnetic tape proof. Films from the service. Multivitamin preparation. A whole range of divining suits. Diving suits made out of sea spider thread. You're crazy, trader. Prepare yourself. I've got a satellite receiver. You can use it to pick up signals from satellites that were fired into the Earth's orbit over 500 years ago. I'll never swear a gun. I promise. I'll go to church. I'll even become a monk. Somebody make him stop. I don't want to buy anything. <laughs> Hilarious. Shalam, Emerald Flint. I am Yala Ragoon, captain of the Star of Bengala. Shalam, captain. What background information do you have on the Seaquay at the Macquarie Bridge? Unfortunately, there aren't any pictures of the black boats. The quake was category 5, almost a deep quake. It worries me. I'd like to sail down with you and have a look around. Our seismographs were able to detect a violent explosion in the Earth's crust split seconds before the quake. I don't like it, Captain. We're prepared to offer 6,000 credits if you'll protect our rescue operation on Ayanta 1 and Ayanta 2. Agreed, sir. I'll dock with the Star of Bengala as soon as I've taken care of business here. Alright. Uh... Oh, one of the Muhammad's. Solemn Atlantium, I am Pakda. You wear a soldier's dress. Are you having a holiday? Maybe. Your sister Sarah sent me here. Said you were a poet? I like you, probably. Have you been around Aqua quite a bit? What have you seen that you are afraid of? I've seen everything. Blood ripped open titanium boats, the fires of battle. I don't mean fear. But the fear of sequels. A sequel can destroy all the works of man. So what? We will build it all again. Sequels, wars, all the same. What have you seen? The fiery sodium waters of Africa. An ocean of red algae. I have also seen the icy columns of the Arctic. Bizarre shapes reaching from the ocean floor up to the palm layer. I saw a Chinese freighter, a glow from blinding magnesium fire. The light of red calamaris, calamaris in the laboratory in the Labrador stream, floods of blue, red and white light like the symphonies of our ancestors played in cold fire. I saw the guard boats of the Shogunate gun down 300 political prisoners in the Okos Gulag. The shallow waters were red with their blood, their guts moving in the tide. Of Spitchbergen, I saw the blinding light of the Aora through the crystal clear ice. Of Sri Lanka, a comet from the unseen heavens fell into the ocean. Okay, bro, I get your meaning. Aqua has a bit more to offer than carnage and exploding torpedoes. Yep. Shalam, who are you? I am Ishmael Muhammad. I'm Flint, hero of the hour. I've heard about you, Flint. It's said that you've got the strength of a sequel in battle. Um, I do what I can. Don't you want me to make use of it for yourself? I've got time and I will make a train available for credits. The House of Muhammad can support you, missionary. We are peaceable, though. And reject force. Talk to Maroon Muhammad. You'll find him on Ganesha, in the Goose Quarters. Thank you, Ishmael. It's an honor to be able to work for the Muhammad family. Um... Yeah... Um, I think I'd better do that other mission and see where I end up with. Yeah, just in case I piss off people. Let's see. Start with Gala, entry point. Right, let's see if there's a smuggler. Entry point 12. Jumpstar, one thousand eighty-three meters. Nothing interesting. All right then. Looks like we've s scouted our surroundings a bit. Let's see. Mission: Disable the boat of the Muhammad's family at Ganesha One. It appears that the Tancred and the Muhammad. I will we'll just read that while we're loading up the mission. How about that? It's the same line anyway. The Muhammad ship. There we go. Paralyzed a Muhammad bomber. Um, it appears that the Tancred and the Muhammad families can't stand each other. Akash Tancred has hired you to paralyze a certain bomber of the Muhammad family. Take some flash sharks, two flash sharks, two should be enough, and go through a mine canyon to a Muhammad family base. Here you will find the bomber. Beware, the canyon is defended by torpedo towers, so stay low. 
Once the bomber has been paralyzed by the flash sharks, a scout from the Tankard family will arrive and capture the bomber. Stay around until the mission has been successfully completed. Uh, let's see. The... Hmm. Okay. Right, Canyon has somewhat of a interesting current. Sonar ready. Good stealth in here, um, but we're not gonna. There we go. Power surge detected. There we go. Now let's see if we can. Power surge detected. Torpedo reaction. Torpedo. Target locked. Target identified. Let's see. Let's get rid of those guards first. It's gonna be hard enough to actually take care of them all by myself. Target destroyed. It's a pretty nasty thing, actually. That's one of the guards. Target locked. Power surge detected. Option torpedo. Target destroyed. Explode it. There we go, the bomber. Target locked. Right, did it hit. Torpedo did ready. Fucking hit. Target locked. Son. Bitch. Target identified. Got two. I got a couple of more. I actually reloaded the previous game just to get a few more of them. There we go. That's a good hit. Torpedo be ready. With those stupid turrets. Target locked. I'm not even aiming for freaking torpedoes. Torpedo ready. Target locked. Missed again. Fucking hell. Useless. Torpedo ready. Target locked. Very good, auto bomber now. Jesus, I paid money Target for those locked. stupid things. Right, oh, maybe that was it. Urgh. Never mind. Now they're not probably not going to take it sitting down, so I'm Power basically surge detected. probably going to see some. Crap. Target locked. Okay, I can do something about that because I knew that there is. of the the Muhammad Target family locked. will not permit this your permission is not required that's a turret which is disabled very much oh there we go that's them target lock power search torpedo ready Right, so, um, so this is a rather ready. interesting mission. <laughs> First we race pretty much all the way over here. Power surge detected. Yeah, we should be able to draw away, away the guards somewhat. Hopefully, um, bring them close to me, away from the turrets. Power surge target. to deal with. Sort of a flash shark. Torpedo ready. Right. Yeah, Target I'm locked. Pull away that bomber a bit. Let's see if that flash shark actually makes it that far. Torpedo ready. It does. Target locked. If we can stay away from his guns, that would be a bonus. Torpedo there we ready. go. Target locked. Now we just need to take care of the turrets. Target sure. identified. Power surge detected. Right over there, but we can avoid those a bit. There we go. Target identified. Target destroyed. The turrets. 
the bomber. Now we should probably hang around here for a bit. Now we're gonna have some incoming. Torpedo ready. Target locked. Torpedo ready. Power in there. Torpedo did. Target identified. Here's my boat. You can actually play like Mission this. Mission target reached. There we go. All pilot available. We got what we want it. Goodbye. Yes, goodbye to you too. Let's see. Let's head to floating Bombay. Why not? Probably best uh, place to restock. We'll skip this part. Floating Bombay. Capital of the clan's union. Good work, soldier. The Tankard family is pleased with you. Here are your remaining credits. It was my pleasure, Akash. Okay, so now we should have... Let's see. Talk to Harun Humama, Muhama at the crew room in Kanishawan. Okay. Um, look. I am Harun Muhammad. Shalam, my secretary Ishmael, will be glad to fix a date for you. Shalam, Harun, I am Lord Flint. Shalam, so you are Flint. My secretary Ishmael said that you wanted to do a little job for us. Yeah, let's hear it while I'm still in a good mood. Um, hold your seahorses for a moment. I don't know too much about the difference, differences between the various family around here. The Tankard family is our worst competitor in the liquid light trade. They use every dirty trick in the book. So, you want to buy my protection, or do you want me to give the Tankard something to think about? No, that would not be our style. All I want is for you to go to the capital with a supply of clothing calamaris and deliver them to my brother Sasha. He'll pay you 5,000 credits. Huh, that's a first. Glowing calamaris. Never heard of those before. They are rarer and more valuable than platinum mud, more beautiful than rubies from the central ridge, and more glorious than sunshine through the holes of the Alvey layer. So, what do you say? Done, I'll take your precious fish to floating on bay. I think I was rooting for the wrong eyes there for a moment. Hmm. Let's see. Let's repair. There we go. And let's restock some. Stuff. There we go. Generator defense. No, wrong button. There we go. Uh, let's get some. Kind of like having a couple of flash arcs with me. So I'll just uh, got three still like that. Cluster bomb. And I think I'll head to floating Bombay to actually. No, wait. Do I have to go again? I actually have to go to floating Bombay, so that will trigger the mission. Uh -huh. Well, fine then. I'll just um, I'll just use older torpedoes then, or I'll just not restock. I've got. Yeah, I'll, I'll be okay, I think. Right. Okay. Uh, save game. Oh, sorry. Uh, Thirty-seven. All right. Let's go. Floating Bombay. There we go. Attack. For the Tancred family, the legendary Indian hospitality does not apply to competitors. At least the ships that attack you at Floating Bombay don't appear to be very friendly. Right. Power surge detected. 
Propulsion torpedo. Now there we go. Ready. Sonar ready. Ow! Fucking hit. Son of a bitch. Target target identified. Propulsion torpedo. Caution, There's actually tankered family members as well. Target locked. Target identified. Target locked. Target locked. Target locked. Target locked. Man, they like their torpedoes. Target locked. Caution, torpedo. Target identified. Kiltic Freighter, if somebody can hear us, please help us at Nav A. Hot thickens. Anarchists are very interested in our cargo. Our escort is dead. Damn it. If only my boat was in such a shoddy shape. <sighs> but, what can I say? Can I say no to a rescue request? Who knows? They might actually have money. Torpedo ready. Hope it isn't too far. Come on, boat. Target locked. A bomber. Great. Target locked. Power surge detected. Torpedo ready. Target locked. Ah, it's not too heavily armored. Easy enough. Target locked. Target destroyed. Target locked. Target identified. Gotcha. Target destroyed. All pilot available. Thanks, it was close. Flash sharks are becoming more wanted. Apparently. Okay then. That's a nice, interesting side thing there. Let's go. Floating Bombay. Capital I am Sasha Muhammad Salam Flint. I brought you these. Okay, I'm Sasha Muhammad Salam Flint. I brought you these weird, glowing calamaries, and I'm looking for prompt payment. It's an honor for me to pay you, Emerald Flint. They're actually very nice. I feel guilty about stealing one of their bombers now. But not too guilty, the both jobs, of course, paid. Fixer. Oh man. Did I miss out on actually seeing that? Oh crap. But can I not, like, buy that? Probably can't afford that. Can I sell this? No. I sell all of these guys, I'm pretty sure that's 1,000, bring me up to 8,000. Yeah, still not enough. Um, wait, if I can go... I can sell these. Still not enough, bugger. I'm not even sure if I can do this. I can't sell that. I could sell a gun, but let's see if I can actually fit this on my ship. would be no it can't be done Bucker. <sighs> that's a shame okay let's rebuy everything like I said there's no loss in cost here it'll cost you this there we go. 
Could have sold that one too, but you know, gotta keep it now. Right, so the upgrade of today getting a better turret and maybe some better software too. Not today. Ah, auto upgrade. So probably a very Punisher. That's enemy ships and vehicles. And then you have the eraser series, which does everything. It's very expensive. Accuracy is very low. So instead I'll just go for a new level of torpedo claw. Right, let's spend some remaining money on buying some torpedoes then. Let's get a couple of man eaters. As a couple as in just two or so heck, I suppose. So, okay. Uh, let's see. 38. It looks like I have to go to the Star of Bengala now. Off we go then. Star of Bengalia. Freighter under Yala Ranjun. Bengalia. Yala Ranjun. Okay. No, it's always easy to figure out how to pronounce all this stuff, you know? Let's see. Does he have? Ah, uh, the basics, I suppose. Doesn't have a fix or anything that, like that, or anything cool. Am I stuck here? No. Right, let's talk to Mr. Rangoon. Shalam, Emerald Finch. Are you ready? Probably means we're gonna be gone here, aren't we? Um, no, not yet, so... Probably gonna leave. So I'm just gonna go a quick look around, make sure that I've, um... Exhausted Floating all my Bombay, missions. Capital of the Clan Zimmer, 1,287 meters. Just to be sure. Let's see, Ganesha 1... Ganesha sure. 1. Quarrying of red deep sea clay. Five thousand two hundred fifty-four right. meters. Sheharazad's sure world. Leisure complex. One thousand eight hundred twenty meters. Yeah. Okay. Pretty much all of this is gone. New Babel. New Babel. Leisure complex. One thousand six hundred thirty-two meters. Might as well. Probably Enter not, though. Jump star, 1, meters. The game's pretty good at telling you where to go and all that. That's it, then. Alright. Star of Bengalia. Freighter under Yala Ranjun. I right, serve so it ready. Okay, let's go. Check out the quake in the data channel first. Uh oh. The E channels and E papers are all talking about one thing the cataclysmic undersea quakes near the Macquarie Ridge in the southern Indian Ocean. First reports tell of thousands of dead. The jump star was completely destroyed, making immediate assistance impossible.
The strange thing is this. They've got a sophisticated warning system, but it wasn't able to predict the catastrophe, and there weren't any aftershocks. Many of the tabloid broadcasts are reporting that strange objects, which could only have come from the surface of the Earth, destroyed the entire station with the effect of a massive bomb. I don't believe it. The surface is dead. Nothing living will ever come down to us, and we're never going up there again. Star of Bengalia, freighter under Yala Ranjun. All right. Damn. I'm getting nervous, Flint. Too much quiet out there for my taste. And all this calm. I've seen it on many battlefields. Aye, the calm of the graves. We're going to find many dead in the Ajanta stations. Yes, I think you should patrol the area. Aye, I'd be surprised if there weren't any looters out there. Yeah, me too. We can't take a chance that anything could happen to our emergency supplies. Okay, um... Go then. Uh, no, no money. Patrol, Star of Benjalia. Patrol, Star of Benja Bengalia. It's quiet out there. Too quiet. Because of the expected plunderers, but also because of the rumors of black ships, you and your companion are on patrol. Visit each nav point. In turn, Starting with Nav B. First head towards Nav B, Scott and Escoche. Sonar ready. Nav B. Sure. Um, right, that scout can probably not match my speed, so. Something there, all right? All right. Star of Bengalia. We have strange regions from the region of Nav C. Take a look at this. seen anything like that in the whole of Aqua. Ho oh, ho 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 You know you're in trouble when that so starts appearing. Huh. Okay guys, report later. Target identification point reached. Have a look at Nav A. Alright, have a look at the let's look at the missions. I will have a look at the Iraq Arnarco. Power surge detection torpedo. Uh oh. Target oh. Okay. Target identified. Target destroyed. Franklin. Huh? Franklin, this is the bastard we owe from the matter of the Gibraltar. Ah, Franklin, go to hell. Guess I just shot down Franklin. <laughs> well, not quite. Let's make sure Franklin doesn't bother anyone ever again. Target destroyed. Target locked. Caution torpedo. Caution torpedo. Lovely new anti-torpedo software. 
Bengalia, we're under attack, return immediately, NAF A. Oh my way. Proper NAV, right? escaped in the direction of NAV D. Track him down. On it. Stop them from plundering. Sure. Power shield torpedo. Target identified. Power shield torpedo. Target locked. Target identified. Target destroyed. Target locked. Kidding me, right? Target locked. Target identified. The Star of Bengalia did its best. After the incident with the strange cruiser, every minute counted for getting aid to the victims of the horrific undersea quake. But what had happened? Nobody on the Star of Bengalia had ever seen such a ship. When it was directly over us, we didn't hear anything except a powerful vibration. All of our electronic gear shorted out as if we'd sailed into a powerful magnetic storm. Hong Lung had spoken of evil from the depths. It became clear to me that she must have meant what we had here, because it was like nothing I'd ever seen. And whatever it was, it sure hadn't come to preach the gospel of peace. No, no, Star of not Bengalia, really. Freighter under Yala Ranjun. Flint, that was one of the mysterious black boats, and we can't even investigate. I, Captain Rangoon, it's paralyzed our electronic systems. God, it's enormous. It must have some kind of electromagnetic stun weapon, or a very powerful energy field. At least it didn't attack us. The electronic systems are back. We're seeing the Macquarie Ridge. My god, the stations look like there's been a war. Do you want me to continue with an escort of a supply transport? Yes, you have to protect the transport of liquid breathing gas to the stations Ariana 1 and 2. But remember, your most important task is to defend against the attacks from the black boats. I sir, let them come. I can get plenty nasty too. And he didn't 
Amy. Son of a bitch. Oh, isn't that just great? Swap out turret, I suppose. Get maximum impact one instead of two. Fix up my boat a bit. Um. Yeah, I'll have to do that. That will not happen. That is also not happening. Seriously? Fucker. Um. I'll end it here. Thanks again for watching. Join me again for more Archimedean Dynasty and maybe we'll find out some more about those weird black boats. Thanks again. Goodbye.